Availability rule sets is a new set of rules that come into play if you want certain things to be available at only certain times of the day or certain days of the week. Uh, but it can also be allowed, used to uh, set closures. So on this video I'm just going to talk about closures. So if you go into rules and availability rule sets you'll see that we have this general availability rule set in here and if you click on that we can go in and you'll see that we already have some dates um, set up as closures and um, so you can also see the uh, block message is what comes up if they try to order something uh, below the minimum order which is we require a minimum order of amount and that's a merge field right there so don't mess with that that'll put in the amount from your um, minimum order and uh, to get back to closures so before I uh, go off on another tangent. Closures is one of the options uh, in this drop down and closures the only thing you have to be careful of is uh, here we have Christmas blocked is this date format so uh, possibly by the time you see this video we'll have a new um, calendar selector but for right now it needs to go year month and date in that order with a hyphen in between each one and then click save so that's really all you need to do um, and then if you weren't aware we do have a good customer bad customer status and if you have labeled them as a bad customer we have a block message here that says the order cannot be completed and uh, it'll have their name in there um, please contact our office to have it resolved so if they've been flagged as a problem child from the last order then they'll be queued to give you a call. So that's what uh, the availability can, rules can do for you. Uh, there's quite a bit more flexibility you can do. So if you have a specific uh, thing that you're trying to make the system do, just give our tech support a call and uh, give us a little time and we can work it out for you. Thank you much. Enjoy your day.